Hey guys, this is Redstone Punk here, and um, today we will be doing a let's play on Scrap Mechanic. If you don't know what Scrap Mechanic is, it's basically a game where you make planes, helicopters, spaceships, cars, and it's all about logic. So what we're going to be doing today is building a little pickup truck. So if we get our lift, and then just get a big space. Yeah, so basically I'm going to start a YouTube channel and hopefully you guys enjoy. Mm, if you like this, a lot of it's going to be on Scott Mechanic. So I can show you how to do moving doors like this. And yes, yeah, pretty cool game with flying vehicles. Because I've made a chinook, but that doesn't matter at the moment. So what you do is you're gonna build up. You do all the detail in a minute. And you're finished. You face these little corners. And then you're just going to build it in a bit, like so, I would say about there, maybe. So all you're going to do, this is going to be where you put all your controllers and everything you need basically. If I just go here and fill this in because it's kind of open. And then build this. You can see what I'm doing, I think. I'm just putting the front of the car on. So then. You're going to need to leave a space for your doors. So I'm going to put two out. Leave a free space so just to mark two doors. And then that's basically done. All you have to do is put your glass in. So if we get some glass blocks, what we can do is put it on a bearing either side so it doesn't get too heavy. Do what we need to do now. Let's take it off the lift. And then in here, I'm gonna need to get a controller. Just make it symmetrical so when you do jumps or stuff or customise it, it's still stable. And then you will have to to that, to that, it's going to be moving that way, let's just say 45 degrees or 30, yeah that looks pretty good right? So then if we put that there, are we going to have a headspace? No. So what we could do is put that there. And then you... Ah, it's the glass that's blocking you. And it doesn't matter, you can crouch in if you want. Either way it works pretty well. And yeah, the controls for this game are basically 
every single game W A S and D. Then you've got your doorway. And all your stuff's just gonna be in the front. Because in the future episode, if you like it, I could do like little convertible cars if you want. So now we're at the back, you might want to make it a bit longer. If you don't like it because it's not on the lift, you can put it on the lift if you want. But I'm not for now. And I'm not making it with concrete. But I'm gonna fix it, as in like I'm gonna colour it all in and change it. So this is where you're gonna carry all your blocks. I'm gonna leave one and see if this other way is better. So if we put that there. Actually, I might. Yeah, I'll do that. Because that's basically the whole thing done. All we have to do is basically all the logic with all the turning wheels, all the engines, and everything. You can maybe fit a little buggy in the back. Because I've got a little buggy that can fit in there if you want. Maybe dig a hole out and then make it so you can put your chair, your um, lift in. So then all we're going to have to do is simply put that there. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Actually. Don't make it. Now I'll make it like that. So we're going to need a big suspension because, well, it should be off road I think and then this is the part with the turn and you can't for some reason place a bearing there so what you're going to have to do is place a block and then a bearing or you can do it with smaller blocks but I'll just do it with this for now and then you can just, just get rid of that put your wheel in the wheels might look a bit small but a lot of youtubers do it and I'll build around the wheel in a minute. There's that. There's some of the uh, wheel done. So we're going to have this one about here, let's say. Line it up. But with this one, I think the suspension, yeah, it's in the same place, but just to make it even, just put two blocks there because your back wheels don't turn in cars. Well, they can, on like a forklift, but. This isn't a full glitter either. So now you can see it's heavier on the back. So what I'm going to do is get my engines and put them at the back. I can make this a bit less. Actually no. If I make these just go up because um, these cars aren't too close to the ground. No, no I'm not. If I just put more counterweight on the back. that work? Yeah. So then we're gonna maybe want some doors, aren't we? So if you just break these blocks, they won't do anything to the build. And then put that there. Same 
on this side. Oh. On the place. Just put that there. Put that down. Oh, I'll get some. <laughs> to do the glass. See, this is why you need mods. Because you can't get glass at an angle. So now I can't fill that in. So what I'm just going to do. Break it and put that there. Still looks alright. What? It's all symmetrical, but why is it on the one side? That's alright. That's on three. Maybe because I've done the door first with all the glass. No, we'll try that in a minute. Just put that there. Break that. Put your window there. So first, what do I do? You put your buttons right there. And just to like hide your controllers, you can put some more weight on the back. Just do four because you're going to need the front to make it all symmetrical. So then this one is going to be connected to that. It all goes right in the end. So then, there's that all done. You can turn it whatever degree, for some reason I always go for 75. And doors open nicely. And doors open nicely. So it's perfectly symmetrical. Ah. That's why. Sorry guys, I've just messed this up. It's just one way over, it's fine. Done it a bit too um, low. But then the back bit's not actually the same. But that's fine. Should I just turn these up? No, that would be too much. Definitely not. We could turn these down. Mm. That won't be as perfect. Still be good though. Mm. So we're gonna need just any one of these, but first we might actually want a driver's seat. So get any driver's seat you want. I'm gonna go for the the four driver's seat. A little passenger seat if it will fit no it will not I'll fix this in a minute Ah. Okay, what you might want to do is mark where this is going to be. So then you can just pop it out. Put 
because still it's not that bad. All we have to do is just put it back to normal. Just like that. And then here, we can just set it back to normal. Take it off the left. Done. Perfect. For some reason, it actually looks better, but. Feather. Let's try three. I know I've missed the front, I'll do it. Oh yeah, I haven't connected literally any of it. I'm usually better than this, it's probably because it's early in the morning. But for some reason I'm not doing this right. Let's just change that just for a quickie. Let's try five, maybe. Ah, that's a lot better. Okay, maybe it's not. I don't know why that flipped over. It's because of the suspension. So I'm still going to use a suspension for this. Just a smaller one. Um, because then it will be in a perfect line and it should balance just about right. Or well, could have just used the big one but um, um, changed these two blocks here to one. Either way it works. Because either way now, that's on three. Okay, they're all on three. Yeah, it looks alright. Not perfect, but it's alright. So all we're gonna have to do for this is break these two. Put these you'll you'll be able to see them and I'll decorate the front in a minute guys. It will all be fine. All I'm going to do is put that there. Hard. Classic. Did it wrong. And place that there. That there. And they'll be moving at 75 degrees. Okay, let's just. It's not symmetrical, but it'll do. It will do. Don't need to do that. Let's click one. So yeah, so now we're going to need a block, we're going to need that, and we're going to need a colour at all.
I just do this on every single wheel, basically. Well, not basically. Yeah, I just do it on every single wheel. So on here, just do it a bit differently like that. You can put them there if you want, but I quite like it like that. Might use it on some of the builds. So now basically done. We need to find the lights for the front and. Something that never fits. I don't think this will fit. Oh, actually. Yes, it will. But not in the centre. Let's make our way with these. That, come on, that has to go in the middle. Yeah. Piece of break. Ah. Uh. And you can do some little things with the poles. I said that weirdly then, I meant poles. Alright, you can make your own little grill as well. On top if you want, or just your own little grill. Make it a bit more realistic, like it's actually connected. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, yeah, I think we're done. We just need to paint it, do it a silverish colour, so white's probably the best.
I will change the wheels because it doesn't look right, I don't think. So it will be changed. Don't worry. Make it a bit dark on me. But still, let's colour them in. Nice black tyres. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. This is actually looking really good. Well, for what I can build, it's looking good. And you can customise the colours, you can do anything you want. So what I'm going to do, not on video though, it's like off camera, is I put some little decorations on there and everything. But, yeah. Just colour it all in. Finish it. I might put a little like speed thing here. That'll look pretty cool I think. Now let's just colour it in. What I might do is put some logic gates, some indicators when you turn it. But yeah, that's the end of this video. If you liked and you enjoyed then please give a like and hit that like button. So yeah, see you in the next video. Bye!